Hi everyone, welcome to our Motion House online classes. I'm Shannon, I'm one of the dancers in the company. We thought we'd take this opportunity to create an outlet for you guys to be able to keep moving in the comfort of your own home. These exercises are designed for you to do at home, static, in any space that you like. So you could do this in your lounge, in your kitchen, in your bedroom, in your garden, wherever you feel most comfortable. So take good care when doing these exercises. Be safe and be creative and we hope you enjoy. So throughout this video there will be some moments of teaching points just to help you get to grips with the movement. It just gives you some, gives you some pointers so you know that you're doing, using the technique properly. Motion House takes no responsibility for your health and safety during these exercises. So please ensure that your space is clear and that you're exercising safely. Make sure you only work to your safe limits, listen to your body, and take good care. Hi everyone, welcome to this week's class. Uh, I'm Joel, and we're going to do basically the same kind of class we did last week, uh, and the week and the week before. Just changing some exercises so that there's something new to add on, and you feel like it's a bit more fresh. Get some water next to you, if you need to stop the video, just stop it and drink some water. I hope you really enjoy it. Let's go, let's go for it. The first exercise, just as we did uh, the first and the second week, just to get some blood moving and, and gets, get a bit warm. Uh, it's going to be the same one, so if we remember it, it goes, uh, start, sorry, with rolling the head left and right four times. Then we go shoulders four times, rolling back times rolling front, then elbows four times rolling back, elbows four times rolling front, then the arms four times back, the arms four times front, and then we have a little stretch, down we go back to crouch, we go to the stretch and we stand up. And after here the music picks up so we're gonna go for the changing legs as we did, with a little jump, and then we open the second, we do the, the four uh, pelvis rotations, just two on each side. After this, we do the swings, be careful about the space. And remember, we want really the swing from the knee to the shoulder, so try and really get your back moving. And then after we've done this, uh, we're gonna go to the, so everything goes to the right. Remember, we open our second, everything goes to the right, we're bringing it down, everything goes to the left, bringing it up, then we do the same one the other way. Back to parallel, we do the stretch again, to crouch again, stretch again, up, and then we do everything again. So these ones, the pelvis rotations, the swings, this one again, same thing. And then just after this, we're gonna bring our knees up. Remember to keep breathing so that we get enough blood in our, in our muscles. Then feet to the bottom, and then a little bit of some squats at the end. Uh, just Try and follow me, I'll tell you the music now. Uh, I know there's some wind going around, so sorry if you hear it a bit, a bit worse. But yeah, I really hope that you, everything's looking fine and you can, you can enjoy this exercise. Two, one, one, now. Start with the rotations with your head. Both sides and shoulders. One, two, three. Really use that plie. Other way. Nice. Try and go as big as possible. Elbows. One, two, three, four. Other way. One, two, three, four. Arms. One, two, three. Or another way. One, two, three, four. Roll down. Find a stretch. Down to crouch. Find a stretch again. And slowly roll up. Ready? Let's go. And change, change. Nice. Use that jump. And remember to keep breathing. Open legs. Round, other way, other way, 
Last one. Swing. Really use that swing that goes all the way back. Ready? Open your second, go to the right. Down. Left. Up. Left. Down. Right. Up. Parallel again. Down. You find a stretch. Down to crouch again. Stretch again. And slowly roll out. Go again, everything. Nice. Keep your knees facing the front. Open legs. All the way. Change. And last one. Swings again. Nice, with the twist. Use your legs to add the twist as well. Right, down, left, another way. Left, down, right, knees up, ready, go. Feet to the bottom. Keep breathing, keep breathing, squats. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And last time, roll down. Find the crouch. Find the last stretch. And slowly roll up. Well done. So the second exercise is going to be the same one with the with the, the last two weeks and it's probably going to be the same one next week as well. It's just to get some stretch and some mobilization in our legs and our back. So if we remember how it went, we breathe, bring everything down, find a stretch, and we slowly go down. We find a little bit of a of some just some time in the crowd, then open to press up position. Find two press ups, really make sure that your wrists are just underneath your shoulders, you're not too open or too far away or too close. So it's a comfy position. Then, after the two press ups, we go down, we find a little stretch, and then we go back to our knees to slowly roll up, bring our arms up, and then have a stretch here. Just try and read with your arms. Then we roll up to find a downward facing dog. We're gonna do two plies here, two plies, and then a little bit of time. Then we're gonna bring our legs to the side. We're gonna lay down, bring our legs up, and then two leg rises. Remember, we want the feet to not touch the floor and no space uh, under our back. So there's no arch here, it's a plank, and we try and get some space under our heels, just two of them. And then we bring the legs down, twist to any, any side you can, to find another stretch here, to go back to our knees, but this time we have our toes tucked, because this will help us to do a little jump, to go back to crouch, to stand up, to find the front. Remember this last uh, handstand doesn't need to be a handstand so much, it's just so the weight goes through our, our wrists uh, a little bit. And then just after doing this, we're gonna do everything again, just a bit more followed, without so many stops. The plies and everything are gonna be a bit faster, so you can just follow me, and I'll be telling you everything the, at the same time that we're doing it. In three, two, one, now. Make sure you have enough space around you. And we're gonna start. Breathe in, arms around, bring them down. Find a little stretch, two plies. And slowly go down. We're gonna open up, 
Make sure that the weight's going through your wrists. And we go. One. Two. And slowly go down and stretch. Nice. Make sure your head's relaxed. Back to our knees. We roll up. Arms up. And then have a little stretch. Find the downward dog. And two plies. One. Two. Have a little bit of time here. You can walk your feet if it's too hard. Bring your legs to the side. And one, two, and slowly bring them down to twist. Have a little stretch. Tuck your toes and bring the weight back. Little jump. And find the front again to go everything a little bit faster. And we go. Round. Down. Two plies. One. Two. Down. Open up. One. Two. Open up. Go back to your knees. Arms up. Find a little stretch. To find downward dog. And plie. One. Two. Legs to the side. Legs up. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. One. Up. Two. Up. Down. Twist. Stretch. Tug your toes. Little jump. And back to the front. Well done. So this third exercise this week is going to be new. Uh, it has a little bit of, a, of the second part of the one we did last week uh, but I'm just gonna go slowly and teach it slowly for you guys. So we're gonna start in parallel position and then from here we're gonna go down with the plie and the body and the arm so everything goes at once so we go down we go uh, sorry so we go down to the right side with one arm and then we bring this arm round to go to the other side and do a full circle to go back to this starting position. And then we do the other side, front, other side with the plie, around to find the same position. We go now to the back, so we go front, we go back, and the back doesn't go to the plie, so we go to the front, and then we just bring our arms this way, and then after this we're gonna go around with our arms to do a little rebound to find the same position, and then we're gonna go right side down, left side, sorry, without a plie, left side down, right side, and open the first. And we're gonna do this, this same thing in parallel, first and second. So in first, we would go down, to the right, around, bring everything down and around, to starting position, and we go down, to the left with the left arm, go round, down, to the center. We go down, now to the back without a plie, we go round, we do a little rebound, and then we do the same thing, we go right, down, left, left, down, right, to open second, same thing, we go down in front, down to the right side, go round, and now all the way round as well, and then we go down, to the left side, all the way round, to starting position. We go down to the back with a rebound and then we do the same thing, we go right, down, left, left, down, right. After we've done this, we've done the three sides and then we go four little rises to get some, to get warm our ankles. So it's four of them and then the fifth one stays, we bring our arms up, we find a balance and then we close to first. And then this time, we're gonna bring back what we did last week, so it's the turn to use. We're gonna go front, side, back, to then shift to the front, shift to the back, close, and then do a full rotation to the front, and then to the front, to the side, and close. And we do this to the right and to the left, so we go front, side, back, shift, shift, close, and then we go round, 
with the plie and half rotation without the plie. After we've done these two sides, we're gonna go to the side four times, two, three, four, and the fifth one opens, closes the pelvis, opens again, same thing to the left, one, two, three, four, fifth one opens, closes, opens again. And we do the same thing we did with in second by in first, so we go four little rises up, and then the fifth one stays, we balance, we balance, we balance, and we find out. I hope this is very clear, if not you can just bring it back, but yeah, the, the last part, it's four tan the fifth, the fifth one goes quite quick to, to close the pelvis, so be ready for that music, and yeah, hope it's, hope it's clear. Three, two, one, now. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight. Front, side, round. All the way round. And walk. Other side, all the way round. To the back. Front, back, rebound. We go right, down, left. Right, first, one, right, over, we go front, to the left, over, to the back, front, back, rebound, we go right, down, left, left, down, right, over, same thing, side, around, front, side, around, the other way, Ooh, sorry, we go front, back, down, right, front, left, left, front, right. Four rises, two, three, four, hold, to close to first, and tap you. Run, two, three, shift, shift, full run, to go half, and close. One, two, three, shift, shift, full round, we go half, and one, two, three, four, five, close, open, and one, two, three, four, five, close, open, four rises, one, two, three, four, and the fifth one, hold, balance, and finish, nice. So the fourth exercise of this week, uh, it's a new phrase, uh, sorry about the wind, uh, it's a new phrase that I created, uh, probably next week we're gonna go back and to the other phrase and we're gonna do the two of them, but this week I'm gonna add another one so that you can feel like it's more fresh and you can keep learning different ones. So the new phrase is quite quick, uh, it starts with parallel and it starts our right arm is gonna go round to the like all the way round to then open up and it's like you grab something and you throw it to the floor so you go round grab drop and then from here from our back is gonna like it's the arms just gonna go round this way and then we're gonna bring the left same way and then we're gonna bring them both behind so it goes down to offer close close back so yeah this first bit goes round you drop you throw it you throw it bring it back after we're here we're gonna bring our two hands up it's like two wings going up and then we're gonna drop in a plie and a little arch to bring our arms behind so if we do all of this together it goes round drop left right then up drop and then timing guys is one two three four five six seven eight one two and uh, after we've done these wings two we go up three four five six and it's a rise until eight in eight you drop the right hand down so you go around two three four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, 
three, rebound four, five, six, seven, drop eight. Nice. Uh, once this is clear, we drop on eight. We go round one, two, three, back four. So this is like the left arm does a full circle and then brings our body to, the, to that side. We do a little rebound to bring everything back. So that step and go round. So we go uh, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. To find the same position we were using before. And then from here we're gonna drop one, two, three, four. So it's like four jumps. So we go one, yeah, sorry, yeah, four jumps. One, two, three, four. Sorry, so if I, if I go again, from here we're gonna drop everything down. We go to the right first, to the left, and then middle. So it's three jumps, not four, three. So we scoop everything up, we drop to the right, to the left, to the center, and then after we've done the center, we're gonna step with the right, because we're doing right side. We step with the right to bring the left one up, to step behind, to step in front, to start again on the left. So this last bit, after we've done the round, we go drop, two, three, four, step, five, six, step, 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 step. And then this would finish the phrase and we'll go to the left. So if we go over the right once more, we go around, two, three, four, five, six, behind, seven, eight, one, drop, two, three, down, four, five, six, seven, drop, eight, one, two, three, back, four, round, six, seven, eight, to drop, one, two, three, four, five, six, step, 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 eight. Nice, I hope it's clear. Uh, this last jump is not a big jump, you just bring your left around and up. So it's like, you just wanna focus on the knee going up. It's like a little jump, to step behind, to step in front. Let's go over the left side. So the left side goes the same way, around, to open, to close, to close with the right, behind, up, down, same thing, to go up, up, and then we drop the left, to go round with the right, to bring the body there, to bring everything back, to scoop around, and then we go to the left first, we go left, right, front, we're gonna step with the left, to jump with the right, step, 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 step. So the left with counts would be one, two, drop, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, drop, two, three, down, four, five, six, seven, drop, eight, round one, two, three, back, four, round five, six, seven, eight, one, left, two, right, three. Four, step, five, six, seven, eight. Nice, hope it's clear. Go back if not, uh, just really look at it with the times because it is quite fast and it's quite continuous. So try and not make it stop. So the, the beginning, for example, you drop, you go with this arm, straight away with that one, you bring it back, straight away you go up, you drop, you go round, you drop, so everything has like a continuous, it doesn't stop. The only time it stops is in the rise, but it's not like a stop, you have to think like, I'm rising, 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 drop. And yeah, I hope it's, it's clear enough. So before we run it, let's try and do left into right, with kind of the same rhythm it's gonna be like, and then we'll do it with music. So we go five. Six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, drop two, three, down four, five, six, seven, drop eight. Round one, two, three, four. Round five, six, seven, eight. Drop one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, drop two. Three, down four, five, six, seven, drop eight, round one, two, three, four, round five, six, eight, drop one, two, three, four, step, five, six, seven, eight. Nice, I hope it's
gear. In three, two, one, now. Ready? Five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six. One, drop, two, three, four, five, six, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. Drop, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Left, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Drop, eight, drop, one, two, three, four, five, six. One. Nice. The fifth exercise of this week is going to be the same one we did uh, last week, the jumps one. So if we remember and go over it, we started in parallel and we do four rebounds, four little rises, four little jumps, same in first, four rebounds, four rises, four jumps, same in second, four rebounds, four little rises, four little jumps, and then just after that we close. So we go one, two, three. We close, we change, we change, one jump to finish. So it's like close, half, half, one on the spot. And then here we start the changing legs that we had. So remember it goes right, left, right, change, change. And this is like a little, a little hop. It's not a big jump, just relaxing the legs. And we go right, left, change, change. Same in left. Remember the head goes with the foot. And then just after this one, we do the same one we did last week. So it's two little jumps to then release the right leg in a little dummy. Same with the left and then the right one goes, slides on the floor and then points at the end. And we do the same in the left. So we go on two, change. This four times. And remember the new one we had next last week, sorry, that went parallel first, close second, open second, to then bring the foot to the front in parallel, to shift, to change leg. So we go right, left, and then without a jump, we just swipe from the back to the front to point at the end to jump. So together it goes close, open, open, close. Left, change leg, boom. Same thing with the left. Close, open, open, close. Left, right, change. And we have four of them as well. And that's the end. So it's the same one we did last week, just remembering it this week. Three, two, one, now. Find a really like a good space to jump in. Ready? Five, six, seven, drop. One, two, three, four, rise, two. Little jump, two. And first. Little rise. Little jump. One, two. Second. Little rise. Little jump. And four, back. One, two. Change. One, change. Drop, drop. And dummies. Change. Left, right, left. Right, left, right. Left, right, left. Oh. Left, left, change, change. Close, open, open, close. Close, open, open, close. Close, open, open, close. Nice. That's it. So as we do every week to finish off the class, we're going to go back to the second exercise we did, the stretchy one, just a bit different and without the press ups and the abs section. It's just going to be a stretch, mobilization a lot slower, so that you can finish off the class by breathing and stretching a little bit. Three, two, one, now. Take this exercise to remember what you did in class and just breathe and enjoy it. 
round, bring your arms through and find a stretch. You can bend your legs if you need, take your time, slowly find your way down to a crouch, try and drop your head all your way down, find the present position just to slowly come down and find a stretch in your back and your abs. Try and relax your head, look around, look up, look down. Slowly go to your knees and roll up. Bring your arms up, stretch your abs and then go down. Reach with these arms to have a stretch in your back. Take your time and breathe. Find a downward facing dog. You can walk your feet if it's too painful. If not, try and stay there and just breathe. We're gonna release the right leg up and through. Try and drop this left knee and just all your weight goes through your hips. And just breathe there. Go back to downward facing dog, left leg gets released, left leg goes through, drop that knee and just breathe, try and feel like your breath just going to go down through your hips, find downward dog again, slowly bend your legs and bring your hands closer, find a little stretch and really slowly Start going up, rolling up, try and feel the weight going down. At the same time you're finding standing up position. Just have a breathe. I hope you enjoyed the class. Thank you very much. As I said last week and the previous week, uh, thank you so much for watching this video. Thanks for coming to watch this class. I hope you're finding it really useful. Uh, I really hope to see you when we're back and I guess I'll see you next week for the last class. I really hope that you enjoyed this class and you learned something from it. Um, keep in touch and keep posted online, looking at our social media on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter. If you want to share with us any footage of you doing these classes, please tag us on Instagram or send them in via email. This would be greatly appreciated. Keep safe, stay healthy and I'll see you soon.